I haven't really, I feel like I'm like relearning or rediscovering who I am and what I'm going to paint. And I feel right now that, but you know, I, I could decide I'm going to do something and like kind of pursue it. I, I want to get to the point where, where, um, see, cause I'm, I'm a very, uh, like cerebral in the way I approach things, do you know? Mm -hmm. And he really is trying to develop more intuition in your decisions. Mm -hmm. And uh, I have to, I, I feel that would be helpful um, for me at this point. It's not like, I think you get, I mean, I know how to mix colors. I know how to draw, you know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, yep, yep. You can duplicate and copy something, but making something from your own, you know, just, and let it, you know, work through it is, is a very, you know, is a very, no, I, 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 I do understand. And when I went to the abstraction, I it went through that process that you're talking about, just letting that go, that, that forward notion of where you're going and being more intuitive. And it's fun when you finally let yourself do it. I'm on the, um, I'm at the doorway. <laughs> I put well, no, my foot in there and I go back, you know. So pushing forward and it's going to take you to a different level. I, I, I really, I'm excited to think about it. Um, I, I think about a, a, a quote that I, Picasso said, it's, it's eliminating the unnecessary. And, you know, that's the artist's choice is to, to eliminate the unnecessary. So you're leaving in what you, you feel as the artist is important. And it's your choice. That's that's the whole idea of being an artist. I mean, especially in nowadays, we can take a picture of anything and put it up there. We don't need to do a family portrait or a, a portrait of the farm because that's the only way they could remember it. We are now in a position where that's not necessary unless someone wants it. So taking out what you don't want, leaving in what should be, pushing what you want, and making that yours and that's what I'm learning to let myself do. Have the confidence to do it. I guess it's, it takes confidence to not just replicate I, what you're looking at, which we can do. Yeah, I mean, I can easily replicate. You give me a right? photograph or I sit for long enough and right. I, I can draw what's there, you know, which you know, sounds like I'm being boastful, but that doesn't necessarily mean that I've really come or arrived yet, you know? No, exactly. Uh, no, I know what you mean. It's getting to that point where you go beyond that and make it into something more and knowing what that is. And sometimes you don't know right away. You're in, you're letting your intu intuition guide you as you move through it and sometimes a painting might sit there for a few days or weeks because you're at a point where you don't know where you're going you're not sure how to finish it because there is no end point when you're copying a picture you know when it's finished and all of a sudden someday you'll come to it and go I know what I need to do I love that well that's it's a challenge he has us working on like six paintings at the same time and uh, not, sim you know, like if we feel like we've lost a place or we don't know, then we go to do something else and we just play, you know, so you don't get like, oh, ooh, I got to make a decision, yeah. you know, yeah. it, it, he, it works a lot on our psychology and our mind and how to deal with, you know, when we get stuck, which I think is yeah. really important.